Hello, and uh, welcome to Outer Wilds. And I know you're thinking I promised uh, Star Wars Battlefront last video, and the standout last video was just a few minutes ago. I'm recording this on the same exact day. Um, okay, once I get off this planet, things are going to be much more laggier. I know this from, from a long time of playing. The reason I'm uh, the reason I'm actually like playing this is because I don't really have a lot of time until I head to school, and I just feel like doing something before going, like just at least two videos. Um, but after school, I'm gonna do a whole bunch more, and I'm gonna see if Star's Battlefront will work during that time. Um, I'll try doing multiplayer um, if if Game Rager does work. So here's the moon. Um, I've already been to all the planets, so it's not much of a mystery to me. Um, I'm, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm in a lunar orbit, it seems. Ugh, dark bramble. Um, let's head to actually the closest planet, if I can find the sun. Oh. Oh. Oh, wait, no. I thought that was like, um... And since I play the game, you're probably thinking that, uh, why don't I just do, uh, teleportation with the, uh, with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Well, I don't want to, because that would really ruin everything, even though I kind of already played the game, and I know you wouldn't like it. Okay, gravity fixes my, uh, rotation. Okay. So we landed on this planet, um... I have, like, I have, like, 20 minutes until I head to school. Probably 18, who knows, um... Between you and me, this is the best stargazing spot in the entire solar system. I've been picking up all sorts of signals through my telescope. The giant pit around us is actually a dried up lake bed. There's a cave entrance at the very bottom. But why would I go underground when I have this amazing view? Okay, I'm probably gonna make voices for everyone. Oh no, frame rate. Oh no. The frame rate eaters. They don't really do anything bad, it just lowered the frame rate, but it always goes back up. Don't really know how to happen. Let's just head into my spaceship. Um oop. Let's, uh, unfocus on that. Um, there's a spaceship on this planet. I know that. A uh, crashed one. Right there. Luckily, I know how to control this very well. Um, through a long time of gameplay. Oh, yeah, this as well. Oh. I actually have no idea if this game uploaded. I mean, either became an actual game or... Or, um... Or, um... I'm trying to think of the word. Ugh, oh, Asperger's Syndrome. You, I know the word, but you just never let me re remember what to say. <laughs> like an old man trying to remember what to say. But the only thing is I'm not old. This is a giant piece of that spaceship. Um, I don't know if the game actually updated or actually became a full a full game yet. What I do know is that any, any alien that survived on here um, got out of the spaceship and died after a while. Pretty sure this planet doesn't have a doesn't have an atmosphere. I think this is planet supposed to be a reference to uh, Mars as well, or Venus. I don't know. I mean, it is it is dried up, but it does have lake wet beds and very gigantic canyons. I mean, see, look at this one. I mean, it's got to be a reference to like uh, it's got to be a reference to Mars. But. People are thinking that that's supposed to be like Mars, but I like to think of it as more Venus because it's more destructive. Oof, shoot. I'm not gonna make it. I might as well just teleport. Uh, 
And I guess that's going to be it for this episode. Um, I'll probably do a second part, but other than that, have a good day. Um, peace.